Welcome back to the Deep Digger Sports Pod. I'm your host, Drew, my other host right over there. What's up? It's D. Good to see you again. So we're going to be talking Brock Purdy, getting that throwing arm ready. Oh, oh my throwing arm's ready for camp right now. Oh, damn. So before we get to that, go ahead and hit that like button. Go ahead and subscribe. Uh, if you're listening on audio, we're on all audio platforms. So go ahead and hit that follow button. Rate us five stars. Uh, if you're on YouTube, again, hit that like button. Subscribe. Drop some comments down below. Appreciate you. Now let's talk some football. Yes. Now, uh, Brock Purdy on track supposedly to start throwing next week we already seen um a plethora of clips of trey lance throwing and sam Darnold throwing but what does that say for you that brock purdy is going to be actually throwing next week i think it's good i mean it shows that the recovery is on track for early this season i don't know how safe they're going to play it as far as putting him in week one but if he's throwing and at full motion through like you know the third game of preseason i know they're probably not going to play him regardless but if he's practicing at full go i think you should just start in week one i i know you like realistically you would want to see if trey wins the backup spot you want to see trey week one against an nfl offense or nfl's defense the way kyle shanahan was play calling for brock purdy because it really did open up the shanahan offense as a whole And if you get Trey in that, who is bigger, stronger arm, faster, more mobile, question mark, then hypothetically, it should be good. But Brock Purdy just kind of something special, dude. He's one of those guys that's sneaky athletic. He does not back down. And if his arm is at 100%, he is the starter of this 49er team, hands down. Yeah, I think he's the starter, hands down. But I will say, like... You got all these uh, tape experts breaking down film and seeing like three clips of Trey Lance throwing the ball and he's fixed. Apparently his, his throwing... mechanics gone or, or all the way there. Yeah, he's perfect thrower now. He's going to be amazing, which we'll see, man. Like maybe because I, I was seeing the article like his finger injury was fucking up the like placement of his hand on the ball and his delivery and that's settled now. So maybe i i want to hold out hope that maybe trey lance is gonna become this superstar guy all of a sudden but it, it's really hard to like make the jump from being so bad and like not playing to josh allen like mm-hmm. jalen hurts level it's I, I don't see how it's gonna be like amazing out of the gate enough for him to win the job from brock purdy well it took josh allen a lot of play time yeah. in order to improve. And that's the thing. Jalen Hurts, a lot of play time to improve. Trey Lance just hasn't had that opportunity. And it's not even his fault, really, because Shanahan, again, the first season really felt comfortable with Jimmy Garoppolo. So you roll with what you got. Like, hey, you know what? We'll we'll play you later. He had every intention of starting Trey Lance in season two. He gave him the keys. He didn't even want a quarterback battle. That's how bad he wanted Trey Lance to get into the game. Just didn't end up working like that. You get to week two, I think it was the first series, second series, and you're out for the entire season. So he just really, things just really didn't fall his way. Do I think if there's any coach that's going to be able to get the most out of Trey Lance, it hypothet- again, hypothetically, it should be Kyle Shanahan. This offense should be amazing with Trey Lance. And I'll even double down. And say, Brian Greasy has been, oh my God, he's been killing it. Jimmy Garoppolo was having an awesome season. Brock Purdy, obviously we've seen what he did. So Brian Greasy in his second year now as QB coach is looking pretty awesome. So maybe he can get the most out of Trey Lance as well. But I think opportunity is going to be few and far between with Brock Purdy at full health. He's going to look better, but it's a question of... He's going to look so much better that it's his job now. Like the keys are handed back over to him, especially with the hype that Sam Darnold's building, the hype that are the trust that Brock Purdy's already built within this coaching staff. It's an uphill battle for Trey Lance, but doors open doors wide open for him right now. But I mean, you brought up a good point. Sam Darnold, a guy who's best friends with your best player on offense a guy who has a ton of playing time and is only 25 years old. So, like, you know and what I mean? It, it, 
would be different know. if there was no Sam Darnold there and Trey Lance was just the guy in training camp and he has more opportunity to just show like, hey, look at these like undrafted guys or journeyman guys that you have me here with. I'm way better than them. But to have it kind of like, eh, it's a toss up between him and Sam Darnold, like that doesn't help Trey Lance's case to become the star of the team. But if he wins it, it's going to be legitimate. Yeah. Like, um, if it had been like Mike Glennon, like I think that's an easy like. Okay, yeah, they're really, really setting up Trey for a, a comeback. Yeah. But I even told you this previously. If it's Sam Darnold, if it's uh, who, Mike White, if it's uh, what the the Commanders kid, Heineke. Heineke. He's not a kid. He's like also thirty years Very old. Very old. Yeah. Uh, if it was Heineke, it's one of those things where you're gonna have you're. It's actually setting up a real competition here. Yeah. Not even for the starting spot for the second for the, for the back second position. string. Well, let us know in the comments uh, who you're rolling with week one. If Brock's semi fully healthy, if he's eighty five percent, yeah, you trusting him to not get re injured, waiting on that. Do you think Trey should get a chance? Like he, we kind of need to see what this guy is. Like, let us know in the comments how you feel about it.